Holy f Hey everyone, Retro Gamer Girl here. My auntie is so kind. Uh, she actually does a lot of op shopping, garage sales, and um, community stuff where she lives. Um, and she has saved these three bags for me um, pretty much over a year period um, and then sent them to me. Um, I've just been to the city to collect them this morning. Um, I really have no idea what's going to be in them. And so I thought, why not record it? Because I've not recorded one of these before. Um, so let's check it out. Start with the big box. So there's three in total, maybe like large, medium and small. Oh my god, this is heavy. It's like one piece. I can't even pull that out. You can do it! Alright, so there's a box. And in the box there is some games. So I'm gonna just pull them out. Discard that. Okay. Um, empty case, but in there is uh, Mario Kart. Very cool. Uh, Mr. Bean. I don't have this one. Um, Merry Christmas, Mr. Bean. Star Wars Lego DVD. Oh, PS2 games. Looks like there's some gems in here. Um, Dragon Ball Z. Uh, Budokai Ten Kachi. I can never say these games. Um, there's a few in the uh, series actually, uh, and that disc is absolutely in mint condition. Uh, my version of this is also platinum, but I'm pretty sure the disc is pretty hammered. So um, that is a great score. Uh, Dynasty Warriors Five um, Empires. Very cool. It's in there. Oh, it does have a cracked case and ripped over it. That's cool. Oh, yes. Um, Dragon Ball Z, um, the Budokai one, but this is number three. I only have the platinum version of this game. Um, the disc is in excellent condition, so I've got one and three there. Ben 10. <laughs> yes, all of them are there. Um, the second one is there too. Um, this one's obviously whoever had it played it more than the other ones, but yeah, one, two, and three, that is awesome. FIFA 09, uh, Rugby League 2, Tekken 5, uh, PC game, uh, Commandos, a double impact, double impact, so maybe a double pack PC. Um, oh, it's, unfortunately it's been wet, it's got quite a lot of mold in there, so um, that one will probably try and save the disc maybe or something like that. Whoa, oh cool. Um Street Fighter on PC. That is really cool. Street Fighter 4. Sweet. Uh, and then a couple more PC games. There's um Super Stunt and Monster Truck Rumble. 303 game collection and the Ultimate Pinball Extreme. And Hunting Unlimited and Sprint Cars some more PC that is awesome so that was just the first little box I don't, oh my god what's next oh how cool are these okay um there's a Yoda clock I haven't seen these before uh, licensed Lego Star Wars stuff uh, 2011 uh, fully working. That is awesome. That is going to go so well in the studio. <laughs> um, and then another character, um, Ninja Go. So it's a Lego one, um, 2012. That is awesome. All right, next. Oh, how cool is this? We soft touch sport kit licensed for Wii for Sonic. Um, it looks like it comes with a bat, golf ball, 
um, sorry, golf club, tennis racket, remote holder, and the racing wheel boxed. So it actually looks like it's all new in there. That's really cool. More Wii accessories, yay! Now this bag was really heavy, so I'm just gonna dig around now and see what comes out. Hopefully not a spider. Okay, so there's some copy DVDs. Um, one is actually Rush Hour 3. That's so funny. We talk about Rush Hour all the time. We haven't got all of those on DVD yet. Um, what else is in here? Um, oh, cool. There's um, DVD sets. Um, so they're all sort of mixed up a little bit here. So um, Suits, Season 1. Oh, <laughs> American Pie 4 Play. Um, all four films, including the most outrageous slice of pie ever. That's pretty cool. Janet King. I haven't heard of this show before. This is ABC, so it's probably an Australian show. Baywatch, season one. What else is in here? Men in Black Trilogy. Oh, yes. The complete tenth season of South Park. Care Bears Movie 2. Suit season three. DCI Banks. I haven't heard of that one before. Let me know if you've heard of that show. Series 5. Not sure what that is. Oh, PC game, Millionaire Manor. So I'll put that over with the um, PC stuff. Um, Empress of the Deep, another PC game there. Grey's Anatomy Season 5. Some more copy DVDs. Um, probably not worth showing those ones. Buzz the Mega Quiz, another PS2 game. Um, the Mystery Crystal Portal. Packed to the Rafters season one. This is an Aussie drama, and the season one was actually really, really good. It went a bit funny at the end. Gossip Girl season two. Almost down the first bag. So I think I think it's just a box in this bag. So instead of trying to like argue with getting it out, I'm just going to pick from it. All right. Oh, Unreal Tournament 2004. PC, this is the edit, uh, Editor's Choice Edition. I hope that's complete. That is really, really cool. This one's got a bit of a dirty disc. Uh, 3D Ultra Pinball Creep Night. Definitely like the name of that. Ooh, there's more games. All right, Ricky Ponting 2007. Red Alert 2. Harry Potter Goblet of Fire. Oh, this is cool. Mega Drive Classic Collection Volume 4. Bejeweled 3. Age of Empires. Oh, Need for Speed Underground 2. Need for Speed Undercover. PS3 game there. Our PC games. Um, Jungle Collection. Lilo and Stitch. Guess Who. Cyber Chess. Deer Hunter 2. And a disc for Black Hawk Down, um, Delta Force. So it'll be a game. It's not really a movie. So I have to go through those a little bit further because I'm not sure what those um, all are. And looks like there's some Wii down there too. Um, Mystery PI. Um, the Ides of March. So it's a Blu-ray. It's cool. Aussie video slots? This actually looks like Australian, um, what am I trying to say? Australian poker machines, pokies. That's cool. I'll definitely be using that. Gattaca Blu ray, Wii Fit Plus, oh, Harry Potter. This is another one I'd need to look up. I'm not sure what that is. Um, the Hobbit. Signs this is one of my favorite movies. So cool. I didn't have any of those Blu-rays. Oh, I don't have this game either. Rocksmith Authentic Guitar Games on the Xbox 360. That's cool. Family Guy the video game on PS2. And Crosstown Heroes, another PC game. Heaps of games. We're still going. All right, 
right, what have we got? Oh, nice. Red Dead Redemption on the PS3. Modern Warfare 2. You guys know how much I love Call of Duty. Battlefield Bad Company, PS3. Uh, over 1,000 Jigsaw Puzzles, PC. Rayman 2 on PC. Mr. B in the Collection, Volume 1, 2, and 3. Now, I do have these on VHS. I do not have the DVD. Super, super pumped about that. Need for Speed Pro Street, Xbox 360. Need for Speed Most Wanted, the PS2. The Sims Hot Date Expansion Pack, Wii Sports, Madden 10. Wow, so many things. Okay, so we're all done with this first box here. Oh, cool. Just Dance 2 on the Wii, Just Dance Best Of, Just Dance 3. Oh, yes. Um, Pokemon uh, Battle Dimension DVD, very cool. Um, I don't own any of the Pokemon on DVD, so that is really cool. Oh, Just Dance 4, Ricky Ponting on PS2, oh, Just Dance, so this is the whole collection there, I don't have any of those on the Wii. Wacky World of Sports, I uh, actually think this game looks really cool. I think I've put this game back multiple times um, when I've been game hunting, um, but it always struck me because of the art style and it's a Sega game, so I'm definitely really excited about that one. Guinness World Records, the video game. I have not heard of that one before. iCarly, I don't know if I'm keen on that. <laughs> All right. So there's some stuff sort of shoved down the side on this and then again another big bag oh, <laughs> oh my god wow I don't know what to start with in it first I'll start with the stuff I just pulled out and then I'm going to show you guys what's in there um retro mega drive game um Australian rugby league that's awesome I don't have that game so yes that's cool oh need for speed shift this is brand new it's still got its seal links crossbow training you can come across this in loads of places i don't know if it's like that around the world for you guys all right but look at this how cool i don't even know how she knows this stuff and finds it but anyway um the gun is in there here in Australia, we uh, had the grey guns. Um, in Japan, they were lucky enough to have black ones. Uh, but yeah, that's awesome. I don't even know if we have the yellow box version of this. I'd really have to go and have a look, but that is super, super cool. All right, let's keep looking. Oh, Care Bear. Oh, there's more stuff in here. Um, Okay, so again, it's bags within bags to protect it. Oh, we've got some shirts. Um, <laughs> this super cool uh, Star Wars shirt. I am your father. Oh, cool. I don't have this one. Um, I think this was released maybe at EB Games, I think. Um, but yeah, I definitely don't have this shirt and that is awesome. Well, I'm sort of lost for words at the moment because we're not even through this bag yet and there's just so much cool stuff. Uh, this is an aftermarket PS2 controller. Oh shit, I don't know what's wrong with this. This is an aftermarket one too, but it's sort of in pieces, but that's fine. Oh, PS2. Oh, there's more PS2 games in there. Crash Bandicoot Wrath of the Cortex. ESPN NHL, the Barbie, the Island Princess, Barbie in the 12 Dancing Princesses. All right, Rugby 06, Smash Court Tennis, uh, WRC Extreme, Need for Speed Carbon Collector's Edition. I actually believe this game has a couple of different variant covers and um, yeah, this one is uh, really cool, but it's not in there. That's okay though. Oh, awesome, Bully. 
Um, Rockstar Games. It's very, very cool. Um, it's got the, it feels like it's got the map in there too. Oh, Ultimate Alliance. I don't have this game on PS2. Band Hero. AFL Premiership 2005. Oh! Uh, so the control... Okay, the controller that was broken is actually attached to it, but there is a fat PS2 in here too, so that is really, really cool. Um, I'll set this up in the studio so I have a PS2 in here. Right, there's something else down the side here. to me. Got some Blu-rays. Um, the Mockingjay Hunger Games, the part one. The Other Woman. Oh, Iron Man 3. I've been working pretty hard at trying to uh, actually um, purchase all of the Marvels. Brave. It's uh, one of the Disney movies I haven't watched yet, so now I have, uh, have to do it. Mar uh, Marvel The Avengers. <gasps> oh, Puss in Boots. Uh, Disney's Tinkerbell, um, Angry Birds Space, that's a PC game. Ooh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Um, the other day you would have heard on one of my videos that I'm collecting all the different versions of the Modern Warfare game, so that's really good to have that PC. Bag 2 down, we're on to bag 3 now. Now this is where Future M tells you that I was beyond excited when I ended up finding out what is in this bag. So I'm already apologizing if I swear a little bit. <laughs> Holy shit. I can't even get into it quick enough. Oh. Lord of the Sword. Oh my god. And it's like, it's complete. That, oh, like I'm speechless. And I think there might be some more in here. Okay, there's more Sega Master System games in here. What? I need to compose myself. All right, I'm just going to start with the left side and then we'll finish off with the right side. Uh, Mrs. Brown's Boys DVDs. Underdog, Mrs. Brown's Boys, Mrs. Brown's Boys now. Um, that's a comedy. If you guys haven't heard of it before, definitely check it out. It's very funny. Um, get your PC started. Pretty funny. Um, Sudoku. Oh, Andretti Racing. This is another Mega Drive game, and it's complete, and it has all its little leaflets and poster. This is so cool. Speechless, so speechless. This is down the bottom. Uh, Solitaire games. Re breed. PC game called Breed. It's cool. Crossword Addict. Oh my god! Oh my god! Um, I haven't heard of this game before. Sagaya? Sagaya. Oh my gosh, it looks like a shmup. Is this Darius? <sighs> There's so cool! Oh, I don't even know what my hand's gonna like pull out next. Katy Perry the movie, part of me? Despicable Me 2? A Master System, oh no, it's a Mega Drive 1. Oh, PGA Tour Golf 2, part. We Sports, Sims 4, Sims 2, and The Inquisitor. 
Sims Deluxe Edition Peggle Nights. Oh, that's awesome. Um, Wee Music in a slip cover. I don't think I've seen that before. Looks really awesome. Oh, you guys aren't going to believe what's in the bottom of this box. Um, the Sims Medieval. Oh, Care Bears movie. Oh, Transport in the Clamshell. Yes. I love having the variants of the different Sega Master Systems. Oh my god, and a Ness, Ness cart, Shadow Warriors 2. I don't have this game, and it's in one of those cool Nintendo cases, which I don't have one of those either. Oh my god, I don't even know what else I'm going to be pulling out right now. Now, I had no idea what was going to be in these, um, and I just ended up finishing with the smallest one last, like I thought, go big to small. Um, Oh, um, submarine attack. That's awesome. PGA Tour 96. Sims 2. Oh, oh, Assault City. Holy shit, I've been wanting this game so badly. Like, oh, this is so cool. Um, I'm pretty sure this game uh, has a few different cover variants as well, and you can use the um, gun with it. <laughs> Speechless. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many other things in there. Psycho Fox. This game is one of my favorite platformers of all time. Um, it does have another manual in here, um, which is Alex the Kid High Tech World. Um, I'm going to put that aside because I don't know if there's. I'm not going to even look yet. Um, but Psycho Fox is complete. Uh, and I'm pretty sure that's in better condition than my one. Um, wow. Stargate. Um, this one looks very, very faded, but it's Stargate um, SG-1. And... Oh no, it's actually Stargate based off the movie, because it has... Um, oh, what's the actor's name? I'll do a pop-up, because I just... I'm just... My brain's going a million miles an hour right now. Um, but yeah, the cart's really good. It's just faded on the front from being an X rental. So I'd say with the lights like sitting on it all day while this has been on a shelf, it's obviously faded, but the back is really good. Oh, Sonic the Hedgehog on Mega Drive. Well, this one's been, ooh, that one's gonna need some love and care. It's, it's stuck, so it must have been wet sometime. So I'll, um, I have to sort that one out. Get it apart. Super Tennis. Jungle Strike. Oh, wicked. Oh, Spider Man on the Mega Drive. Oh. Okay, this is literally the last pile now. Um, there is nothing else in here. I'm going to throw it there, um, but there is a boxed NES game, um, To The Earth. I do not have this game. Um, I, yeah, use your zapper like gun to blast deadly UFOs, hurling meteors and angry aliens on the cosmic battlefield. This is one game I've always wanted. Um, it just, it, it just, oh, it's just sitting there. Oh, another one of those cases. No, two of those cases. Um, the Ninja, my version of this is absolutely hammered. So, yeah, this is really nice. Um, clean for an X rental. Uh, there's another one of these super cool cases with um, Mario and Duck Hunt. 
And lastly, um, the last game out of all of this um, happens to be um, Side Pocket, which is um, a Data East um, snooker game. Pool. We call it pool. Maybe it's called snooker. Um, in another one of those cases. Literally, I can't believe what is in all of this. Um, my auntie absolutely rocks. So this is stuff that she's just collected for me um, over the space of a year and uh, sent to me. Uh, she knows that we love movies and um, you know collect Blu-rays and stuff like that and um, always know my love for games. Um, it's actually the same auntie that bought me my two copies, um, the Donkey Kong 2 uh, and Donkey Kong 3 on the SNES when they were brand new and Myers and um, yeah so she obviously most of my birthdays when I was growing up would always sort of grab me a game so um, I'm just really really shocked uh, that this stuff was um, found and yeah that she was able to send me some some of this stuff like just send me this oh yeah it's totally um, totally, totally awesome. Uh, so yeah, now I'm going to go and clean it and definitely check out all of these uh, retro games. The new ones can just stay there for a while. I'm going to check out all these games that I haven't played before, um, especially To The Earth. Uh, thank you everyone for watching and I will do a follow-up video from this one once I've cleaned everything up and show you guys a closer look and maybe a few reviews on some of the games I've never played before. Um, I'll talk to you next time.